Hi this is Akash your host let's start our class i hope you will watch the video completely and get this shadow effects done we made this wrap text logo in our previous class and this is our channel's cover i will show you how to make this shadow effects like this one go to files new width will be 1920 pixel and height will be 1080 pixel and please rename it Select type tool. Try select this kind of bold fonts if you don't have this exact font. Now adjust the font size, please. Right T and adjust it in the middle of this canvas. Control J or Command J to copy this layer and move the copied layer to the right side and edit it. Make sure you have selected the auto select option so that you can select every layer by click on any letter and move it to the right side. Double click on this layer to edit it. Press enter for get rid of edit mode. select the top layer and hold shift plus left key to the bottom layer so that all four layers you can select and move all these four texts in the middle of this canvas so that it will look better select first layer and click on this icon so that we can add a mask select gradient tool make sure linear gradient is selected now select this black and white mode Make sure your foreground is white and background is black. Now hold Shift plus Left key and drag the gradient line from right to the left. You can see that is wonderful. The steps will be same for the letter E, X, and T. Make sure you have selected the auto select mode and drag the E layer above the T layer. Same for X and T also. Select the top T layer and hold shift plus left key to the bottom layer so that all four layers you can select and press Ctrl G or Command G. for make a group and click control j or command j to copy the whole group select the group one and go to edit then transfer then flip it vertically use your arrow key to move the group one to the bottom or you can uncheck the auto select mode and select the whole group one You can use your keyboard's arrow key to make it perfect. Now reduce the group one opacity to 
25%. Select gradient tool again. Select the group one and click mask icon to add a mask. Use the gradient tool to add fade out effects from the bottom to the top. Now it's looking perfect. Please leave a comment and subscribe.